My name is Myron West. This is my wife, Holly, and my son, Ryan, my daughter, Rachel. And uh, we will be moving in June of 2013 to Gulu, Uganda with Four Corners Ministry uh, to serve there. We're very excited at the journey that, that God has had us on. It, it, I think it started uh, when we were little children, but we didn't realize it until uh, about three years ago. God really began to... To, to put a burden on us and, and to really uh, really get our attention with some things. Some friends of mine uh, got together and, and we decided that we wanted to uh, go to an unengaged people group and, and share the gospel with them. It's something that had been on our heart. And uh, so me and, and a few friends went and to Guinea, West Africa and shared the gospel with, with the Kakabay people that had never before heard of, of Jesus. And, and while I was there, it just really sunk in with me that, that I can make a difference. God can use me to, to make a difference th there in this world. Everybody and, and so. keeps asking me, Holly, are you sure this is what you want to do? And the only way I can respond to people is, you know, no, it's not what I want to do, but I know that it's what God wants our family to do. And after Myron came home from his first trip from Guinea, he, he was a different person. He had Africa on his mind like every day. I said, you must really love these people to stay on this plane for that long. And uh, anyway, when we hit the ground and went to our first medical clinic, uh, I understood his love because I fell in love with the African While I was over there, God showed me how desperately these people need godly love and that I could be used to show them that. I played soccer with them two days and they, they completely loved soccer and they were not sad, they were always happy. And it showed me that I can go over there and I can make a difference. I like playing with the kids because they're fun to play with and they're real funny. There's this one little boy named Maurice. He was real fun to play with. He followed me and Ryan around, and he drank my water when he found it just laying on the ground. Uganda is, is a country of about one to two million orphans. Uh, the, the average income there is a, is a dollar a day. They've been torn with about 50 years of, of civil war. Uh, war of, of various kinds. Uh, there's uh, AIDS, uh, no safe drinking water, uh, very little access to education or, or medical care. Uh, just a, a country that, that's just in a, a tough, tough situation like many others. But, but God uh, broke my heart about those people. I fell in love with the people there, as did my wife and, and my children. And, and we really began to pray that, that God would continue showing us, you know, what, what's our role. If we, if we can make a difference there, uh, how are we going to do it? What's our role? And, and after much prayer and, and, and consulting others, and, and uh, we really, God has confirmed in many, many ways that, that, that we're, to, we're to move there and we're to live life there discipling these people. Uh, the country has uh, calls themselves Christian. Uh, very few know what that word means. Uh, they think they're Christian just because they're not Muslim. Even though there's many Muslims there, uh, what we see mostly there is witchcraft. Uh, there, it's, it's basically a, uh, a curse that, that the devil has, seems to have put on those people. But we want to go there and we want to disciple them. We want to plant a church. And we're going to be a part of, of Abana's Hope, which is a children's village that Four Corners Ministry has is building in Gulu, Uganda. They've bought a hundred acres of land. Uh, they want to build a, a school, a medical clinic, a church, uh, and, and some other facilities there to, to help people with, with micro-business, just to create generational change, but, but, but to do it through the body of Christ and to teach these people that there is a God in heaven that, that loves them, uh, that, that they're, they're not the world's garbage, as I heard one uh, one say at one time, they, they are, uh, they're loved by Christ, they're created in His image, He, he loves each and every one of them, and uh, we're going to move there, we're going to help uh, operate that children's village, uh, we're going to help plant a church, we're going to help in whatever ways uh, God requires us to do, but we need your help, we need uh, monthly support, we, we need to raise money to, to build our home there, 
uh, and we need to raise our, our, our just our, our monthly support to, to live on. It doesn't take much, but we, but we need your help, uh, whether it's a, a one-time contribution or, or a monthly pledge. Uh, you can become a part of this with us, and, and it will will indeed make, make a difference in the kingdom of heaven uh, among the Acholi people there in Gulu, Uganda.